Hey everyone, it's Renee and welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to show you guys how to make magnetic nail polish. It's so insane, I can literally play with these magnets for hours. This month I'm going to be doing my first giveaway ever. I'm going to be giving away an Amazon Fire HD8 tablet. The winner can choose which color they want, black, blue, pink, or orange. I'm going to announce the winner on April 23rd. The only rule to enter this giveaway is that you must be subscribed. Also, if you want a bonus entry, you can follow me on Instagram. So make sure to subscribe and also hit that notification bell so you know when I post new videos. That's enough chit chat, let's get started. The first step into getting magnetic nails is to apply a clear base coat. Now I have my nails looking nice and glossy. Now I'm going to be putting some iron filings on my nails and this is what's going to make my nails magnetic. I got these iron filings off of Amazon so I will leave these down in my description box. So I actually did some research on whether these iron filings were safe to use around your skin. So it does say if you're a young child and you're being directly exposed on your skin to these iron filings that it might make your skin sensitive. So I guess if you're not handling these iron filings like directly on your skin for long periods of times, it should be pretty safe. Also make sure you don't ingest any of these iron filings, also keep it away from your eyes. But I'm just going to be sprinkling these onto my fingernail. That shiny base coat that I applied is going to give the iron filing something to stick to. And I probably should have done one nail at a time because the nail polish is starting to dry. So reapplying some of that clear coat. Okay, so now my nails are covered in these iron filings. So now I'm going to cover my nails with a colored nail polish. So I picked out this like silver metallic color. It kind of reminded me of what magnetic nails would look like. It kind of looks like a sparkly metal or something. So I'm just going to go ahead and cover over top of the iron filings. So I definitely applied a really thick coat of nail polish because you don't want a magnet to like rip out the iron filings out of your nail polish. I'm going to use this sparkly nail polish over top because I feel like it's going to kind of like disguise over this like grainy texture. I definitely think it helped it look like it doesn't have big pieces of iron filings underneath of it. I feel like my nails look really futuristic right now. So now the last step is to apply a top coat. It's really important to let your nails fully dry before you put any magnets near them. Otherwise, it's going to rip your nail polish off and then your magnet is going to get really messy. Okay, now let's see how magnetic these nails are. Whoa. Whoa, it feels so weird. Whoa, it feels so weird. I can feel the magnetic sensation in my fingertips. Whoa. If I get the magnet like too close, it just pulls my nails. Whoa. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, I don't think my nail polish is dry yet. Okay, I'm really impatient. I should have waited longer. Okay, I wonder if I can like pick up the magnet with my nails. Okay, this is literally like insane. I could seriously play with magnets in my nails for hours. I love this magnetic nail polish so much. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this DIY. If you liked it, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!